Dr. Magdi Alexander has been in private practice for over 18 years and has performed over 1,000 hernia repairs. He received his combined Masters of Science and Medical degree from the Chicago School of Medicine before completing his residency at Kern and the University of California San Diego Medical Center. Dr. Alexander is board certified by the American Board of Surgeons and a multiple recipient of both the America's Top Surgeons Award and the Patient's Choice Award among numerous other accolades. He is a professor of surgery and holds many high-level posts at some of the most prestigious hospitals in Southern California. Dr. Alexander, thank you so much for joining us today. Hello, Molly. So we're here to talk about hernias. Uh, it's a common problem that a lot of people have. My family's had it. Um, I know a lot of my friends have had them. What exactly is a hernia? Essentially, a hernia is a defect in the muscle or the membrane of the muscle that allows an organ from the inside of the abdomen to protrude towards the outside. And is this something that is visible? How, how would you know that you have a hernia? Some people don't even know they have a hernia. Mm -hmm. Others notice a bulge, other people have pain. Mm -hmm. Sometimes the patients find out about it when they go to a standard physical examination by their primary care doctor. And is it something that always requires surgery or is it something that you can fix through medication? Hernias always require an operative intervention to repair them. Some individuals are able to avoid surgery by wearing devices that are kind of like girdles. Okay. This is essentially not a fix, but rather a support. But most people, I mean, you would say that everybody that has a hernia at some point should probably get it taken yes, care of. Yes, I would say surgery. absolutely that if you have a hernia, you should have it repaired. They never fix themselves. You can't use medication to make them go away, and they always get bigger. And the larger they are, the more intense the surgical intervention is to repair them, and of course, the longer your recovery time is. Right. Do they, I've heard that at times they could even be life-threatening. Is that true? Hernias can strangulate, mm -hmm. even though that doesn't happen to the majority of people. Mm -hmm. A hernia that goes through the defect and then cannot go back outside can actually choke itself off, mm -hmm. and that may require even more significant surgery, and it can be life-threatening. Right. So what does the actual surgery entail? What, what do you do when you're in surgery with a patient? All hernia operations, no matter what methodology is utilized, essentially repair the defect mm -hmm. through which the, the organ is protruding through. Um, that can be done by a conventional method where a cut is utilized and a patch mm -hmm. that we call either mesh or biological patching material, mm -hmm. or it can be done as a telescopic method that people call laparoscopic surgery, minimally invasive surgery, or keyhole surgery. What is the, what's the benefit to having laparoscopic surgery? Laparoscopic surgery tends to have a, a shorter turnaround time with a shorter recovery and less intense pain. Mm -hmm. Not all hernias can be done laparoscopically and there is still room and need for conventional surgery depending on the type of hernia that you have. Would you say that the recovery time is, is short? Uh, what, what are people looking at in terms of recovering and going back to their everyday lives? In the vast majority of time, people having conventional surgery can return to work within two weeks. Oh, okay. People having laparoscopic surgery usually can return with one week. Most people can return to their regular activity within one month's time. Mm -hmm. That involves working out or vigorous activity. Right. What you're doing is creating pressure in your abdomen and that allows the protruding structure to protrude out further, not only enlarging the hernia, but also increasing your risk of strangulation. Dr. Alexander, thank you so much for being here. Um, we really enjoyed having you. Thank you, Molly. To learn more about hernia surgery and Dr. Alexander, visit www.socalhernia.com or to schedule a consultation, call 877-919-9997.